So we're heading from Sunderland down to Grimsby Town, where I was born, to see my grandma and granddad and spend a week with them. All my life they've been a massive, massive support network to me, my grandma and granddad. They've been there through so much. I, I had quite a tough childhood in a lot of ways and they were just constant through that. And what has always really hurt me is that for as long as I can remember, they've had a bit of a shaky marriage. And this week I, I want to bring my old grandparents back. I want to give them the gift of a renewed relationship, a new lease on life. I, I want to help them let go of their past mistakes and regrets and all that baggage that they must be carrying so that they can move forward into their later years happy together. If when I've gone to all these lengths of planning everything I have for this week and, and even I can't help, then I don't know. I, I honestly don't know if they'll last. I think they'll continue to resent each other. Their issues will continue to build and then they'll hit breaking point. And then they'll be spending their last few years on their own. I love it in here, I'm just, I can do. It's like all them different woods up there of a pen. You wouldn't believe how many different woods there is. Does it not get lonely in here? <coughs> no, I've got my I've got my sacking system in there, radio, CDs, and everything in there. Here's my sacking system. <laughs> <gasps> In general, we just, you know, we just get on. Mm -hmm. I don't know how we upset each other, but you don't linger. It's like if I have this and gets in my head, I've got to say it there and then. I will just say it. And that upsets them. But then again, 10 minutes later, we'll discuss it. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry for that. I'm sorry for that. That's it. End of story. We don't take it to bed with us, it's just done. Over carrying the rest of the day. Forget about it. People who have been married from numerous years, years like ourselves, oh, we've never had an argument, never done this in life, but we've never been married. Because everybody who's ever married, they have call out, but they know each other inside out. He do not really communicate with what he's feeling like sometimes, and that is, it's, Key. The communication is the key because none of us, the pair of us, don't say how we feel. They're about to get up and get this task one. Uh, yeah, it's gonna, <laughs> they're gonna find this <laughs> really hard to do. Like, my granddad does a letter in the shed. And the whole point, both of them have talked about a lack of communication um, and Grandma wants to do more things together. So, hopefully this is going to achieve that. But um, the cynic in me thinks it might go south, but we will see. We will see. Oh, look. Grandad, lead Grandma to your shed. You must guide her through making her own pen from scratch. Oh, is that easy? Only instruct him through demonstration or verbally. Hmm, okay. How do you think that's going to go? Uh, I don't mind showing a pair of middle gun laid. Well, the, the, the task for you to complete, my grandma has to make her own pen from scratch, you can demonstrate. You don't think that she'll be able to do it? The lane's a bit hard to do. I'm not going to go on the lane, mate. This. That goes on first. Mm -hmm. Up to there. Then you've got a space room. Yeah. Onto there. Slide that one onto there. And screw it. 
and you put a spacer on yeah, it. Yeah, that's pen. Then yeah. that spacer. Yeah. Yeah. Is that a screw? No, that's a spacer. That's a smaller one. Onto there. I put that on. Now, where you stopped, hang on a minute. Where you stopped, you took more wood off there mm. and the rest of the pen. Okay. Because you, you stopped. Uh -huh. right. Now, you can't have that because you'll have an Indian in the pen. That's all got to be level. I'm not to be a perfect pen, but I'm only having a pen. Well, that's There you go. That's it. Okay. Let me just show you there. That pen's coming out of that one. Yeah, so that has, like I said, you have to stop on that thing, you want to look at it. Look at nothing different. So you know you turn the pen in and out now, look. Yeah. Yeah? Out of 10, I'll give it 10. Yeah. Ooh, 10 out of 10. Wow, yeah, I quite like it with two colours. I think you should do some of them. Yeah. Damn. Wow, impressive. So have you enjoyed it? That's made out of. I really of, have enjoyed it. That's made out of sapiwi and wenge. Sapiwi and wenge. Wenge? <laughs> Not winge, wenge. <laughs> now, we are moving on to task two. And to be honest, I am cacking myself a bit about this one. I think that um, it's something that you might struggle with. Um, it's definitely something that's the unknown uh, and it will definitely test your newfound communication skills. Oh god. Read it out. Pack your bags, get out of the house. <laughs> what that actually say? <laughs> pack your bags, get in the car. You need to go and pack your bags, we're going on a trip. We don't know where we're going. He don't know where he's going. And he's got to rely on me to get him there. A bit anxious, really. I know about navigating on a map. It's a long time since I've done that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he probably thinks that he can do stuff and that I can't do stuff. Like with a pen. It's, you know, that was like, I am thinking, oh, gosh, you're not going to do this. But sometimes when I'm thinking, it's going to think that, so I'll, I'll be like, right, I'm going to do this <laughs> to my best ability. Can we go in there? What? What account? Yeah. What do you need? Big bag out, Matt. Um, we need a pen to go out. Please answer me, please. Well, can you answer me then, please? What are you looking for? My bag out the car. This is where it all starts. Okay, so we're on a beautiful long A road um, and they're on track. Uh, obviously, I'm not in there. I don't know how well they're communicating, but they're doing pretty well. Uh, they're following it. Like, couldn't say, like, I don't know how because I wouldn't be able to, um, but something's obviously going well. I think they do actually make a good team. Like, yes, they wind each other up and whatever, and I'm sure that they're having some little squabbles, but they're getting there and they have no idea where they're going as well so uh, I'm pretty proud of them I think, uh, I think it's going well. Oh for God! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Oh, 
not sleeping in that thing, I'll find it. Yeah, wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, this is task one. of you is a tent. Grandad must give instruction, only verbal instruction, no physical assistance. Grandma. Oh, so that's why we're going to get dark, is it? Must set tent up. You have one hour. Really? Hello? Is this the right way up? This Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What's that from? Wind blowing that way. Mm. So it must be that side. Too. What, the door? The wind's not blowing in the door. Here we go round the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> Get the poles. Um, That's the base. Yes, I know what the base. The base goes in the middle of the tent. Right. But you've got to get the, that end into the top of the tent and slowly pull it up inside. Right, say that again. Don't, in braille. Don't, don't be sarcastic. You've got to Put it in forty five oh, minutes. I'm gonna do it. Grandma. No, I'm not stopping. Would you like would you like us to have you both do it as a team? No, You're more than welcome to do it. I know, because it's you. So we're just taking the cameras away, um, they're getting a little bit overwhelmed with this challenge so we're just going to take a step back and let them breathe and give them a moment. I regret not loving you more. You say, oh, we've both got more love for each other. But it's just showing it. Yeah? Do you agree on it? That means a lot because it just makes you feel a bit more loved. Um, and there's a bit more affection there. Yeah, it does mean a lot. Yeah, it's nice to be loved, isn't it? It's nice to know that you love. Of so many flowers, and why even when he was at sea and stuff. Because, in fact, it's always a lot of flowers. How about them? So I was just able to cry my grandma's ring on her finger. Um, she's really superstitious about it, she did not want to give me it, but the reason that I did it is because my granddad said that he has no regrets and that he would marry her all over again. And I think after this week, best way to really cement everything that they've learned and they both really have like developed as people in this week is 
is for him to renew their vows. Deck of cards, she's the out on the top. No spade, she's her. And that feeling is in your heart. And it comes from your heart. If it's not in your heart, you're not going to do it. If you're not in love, you're not going to do it. That's what getting married is not. We gather here today to witness a celebration of renewed love and commitment as Jean and Terry Harris renew their wedding vows after 47 years together. As they embark on this journey once again, let us honour their enduring commitment that has led them to this joyous moment. The course of true love never did run smooth and they have faced challenges both together and apart during their marriage. Now agreeing to cement their newfound relationship, those challenges, doubts, regrets, and negative energies shall not pass with them into this new renewed marriage we establish today. Today, supported by the love of our family who are thinking of us in this moment, and showered by the warmth of those family members looking down on us proud, let us bear witness to the rekindling of a flame that has burned for almost five decades. Oh, <laughs> From this day on, I will love you, underlined, with all my heart, underlined. And to move on into a better life, together, underlined. If it wasn't for you, I would not have today. The day we met on your 18th birthday, a long while ago, to present day, I still love you with all my heart. <laughs> Terry, you are my world. From the time we met, you have made me laugh with all the funny things you do and say. You are caring, kind, and there for everybody. 
you are my safe and secure future. You are hard working and clever. I love the way you can put your hand to anything. Mend the pipe. Sew a pair of trousers. Make a pen. Not spooky. I love our family time together. Our strolls in the park, weekends away. I love the way we reminisce together, look back on our lovely memories. From this day on, I will love, cherish and appreciate everything you do for me. I will respect your wishes and opinions. You are my life. I look forward to our journey through retirement our relaxing years, time to concentrate on us and our, journey, and our journey together. I will give all the love I have to give until death is due part. Grandad, please repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, symbol of our love, symbol of our love, I renew my pledge to you. I renew my pledge to you. To honour you and cherish you. To honour you and cherish you. Today and always. Today and in sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Through the bad times and the good. Through the bad times and the good. May it signify the unbroken circle of our love. May it signify the unbroken circle of our love. And the clouds parting. And the clouds parting. As we embark on our continued journey together. As we embark on our journey together. Thank you, Grandma. And Grandma. If you could please place this on Grandad's finger and repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, symbol of our love, symbol of our love, I renew my pledge to you. I renew my pledge to you. To honour you and cherish you. To honour you and to cherish you. Today and always. Today and always. In sickness and in health. <laughs> through the bad times and the good through the bad times and the good may it signify the unbroken circle of our love may it signify the unbroken circle of our love and the clouds parting and the clouds parting as we embark on our continued journey together we embark And now, by the power vested in me, I'm proud to pronounce you once again, Mr. and Mrs. Harris, husband and wife. And to celebrate the beginning of this exciting new chapter of your journey together, you may now kiss the bride. Congratulations. <laughs> 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 I love you. <laughs> Thank you. Like an angel in white on the way. Can you be like a drone straight from a song that I've known all along? Can you?
Burning like some bottle rock 